Good morning everyone. It is officially Lund Diary Day, I believe five, and we are in Leicester Square something square. And <laughs> we have officially picked up our One Direction tickets. Maddie, may I use one for just reference of how beautiful these beautiful things look? Um, I don't know if I've officially told you guys the story about why we have come over here, but we're gonna do that later because I don't have the time to do it now. But Um, I'm just trying to paint visual. Basically, we had standing room tickets for a really long time, and then Maddie invited me to the concert, and I slowly but surely realized that with my cerebral palsy, balancing is hard enough, let alone when you're being pushed and shoved um, by screaming horny fans. And, um, okay. <laughs> I'm serious. Think yep. about that. That's what, that's what, just said. that's what's gonna happen. Yep. Um, so we made a YouTube video. Um, we can put the link to it in the yes. video. Yes. We'll, uh, we'll link it. There'll be, there'll be a link. Let's see if I can get my finger on the shot. There'll be a link right there. <laughs> All right. Um, and asking for, um, people to share it. And so maybe we could get our seats moved. And then, like. It's called Across the Sea for 1D. It is. Hashtag. And, um, hashtag, hashtag Across the Sea for 1D. Hashtag. Um, and then about two months later, I got an email. Um from someone I didn't know and the subject line was One Direction and I didn't really think anything about it for some reason but then <laughs> <laughs> Maddie crawling on the floor <laughs> but then the um first line of the email was hi Sydney Morgan Spurlock and Morgan Spurlock is one of my favorite directors and he directed This Is Us so as which is the One Direction I, movie <laughs> so um I kind of realized at that point that it had worked and we got our seats moved. Now, but we um, essentially got our seats swapped out and they look like this beautiful, beautiful thing at this current moment. We don't know exactly where these seats are, but um, they're gonna be amazing. Hopefully so we have- looks like this. <laughs> yep, I'm holding the merch like this as well. And we're going on the 8th. So it is almost time, it is almost time but, oh, I'm very zoomed in. I'm very zoomed in, I'm sorry. I'm but we are now going to try, I think, to do a bus tour of London, because I feel like that's the easiest way to do it. We we're gonna try to do it on our own, but we're gonna see if, if it doesn't completely break the bank. We will probably do that, so we're gonna track that thing down. We saw it on the way in. We don't know where it is, but we're gonna find it. And we will be in just a momento. See you guys in a little bit. in London. <laughs> Thank you. 
on and off the bus stop. And we're having lunch, little, little picnic-y lunch here in front of none other than, you know, this guy here. Mr. Big Ben and whoever this guy is. I don't know who that guy is. Winston Churchill. Winston Churchill. Wow, we're having lunch with Winston Churchill. It's gonna be a fun time. Back on the bus for round two. Look at that display. We are officially back into the hotel room. It is past midnight. I don't know exactly what time is it, it is. Really? Yeah. It it's is like 12... 12.25. 12.25. We are back in the room. We got successfully partially lost in... What is that? What was that called? Hyde Park. Hyde Park. We kind of went from one opposite end to the other, but it wasn't exactly the end we needed to be at. But we made it back. It was a journey. It was a frustrating journey, but we're here. And we went to Spaghetti House for dinner, and now we're just going to bed. We've been showering and things. It's been boring, but that will be the end of today's vlog. And I will see you tomorrow in Lundiary Day.